my Jet 1100. I am reorienting the uh, shroud for the impeller. All you do is take the impeller off. There's two Phillips head screws here. You take them out and then there's some, I believe, bolts that you have to get from the inside of this so it cannot be mounted for you to reach it. I believe they're half inch. Anyway, you take it out. What I'm doing, I've done this many times, make a stencil. I taped a piece of paper on the inside just to orient the holes. And I will rotate it 90 degrees and drill the new holes, mount it, and have the shroud point in the direction I want it to. The old holes, I'll just put duct tape over them. It ain't going to hurt shit. So, this will get me out of a bind. I have clearance issues with it near my garage door. So, this will help tremendously. Anyway. Alright, we turned it roughly 90 degrees. Um, just to know, note that the chute is, of course, more offset. So, where it was positioned before, originally here, was the bottom, and it was flush with that mounting plate in the back. Now you got about a almost an inch of overhang, which really shouldn't mess anything up because I'm hanging mine on a uh, two by ten, so I got an inch and a half of clearance off the wall. So go ahead and bolt this up. So here's the new offset, flush on the plate. So I mean. It's maybe not even an inch, but it'll be fine if you got a 2x4 mounting it. So originally I had this uh, exit chute pointing towards the middle of the garage. It was roughly right here. Garage door kept hitting it. Well, now I have clearance and... Uh, this is roughly what I did. I don't want to filter the air. I just wanted to do a pre-filter before it got to the um, impeller. And basically all the fine dust goes out the window. It's such a minimal amount that I don't really notice that I've cut MDF for most of a day and hardly any of it's outside. So, I mean, it's, it's negligible. I catch everything in my salvage drum seems to work really well but kind of like the old AC units you put in the windows I just made a <clears throat> I just use a ducting flange and reduce the five inch for this size and it uh, goes right out the window and sandwich it closed with the window 